budgeters and savers, Chris Budgets here, and thanks for coming back to my channel. I have a different kind of video today. If you guys follow me on Instagram, at Chris Budgets, you know that I did win a very special giveaway from Gabriella Budgets, and her page, she does budgeting updates, and she also has an Etsy page. So she was doing a giveaway, and I won, you guys how exciting um i actually got this package like a while ago and i just wasn't able to unbox it yet um, i did want to do it on camera i did want to share with you guys because it was a super fun giveaway it was a very generous giveaway um so i did want to share and what the prize was was a set of cash envelopes cash envelopes from her shop an a6 clear binder a cash breakdown slip and then also a set of trackers um, the trackers weren't on her shop at the time I'm not sure if they are but she was also giving away the clever Fox budget planner and no spend stickers so that's what she was giving away it was super exciting super fun um, super thing I'm super thankful that I won because I have actually been wanting to try out like those a6 clear binders that I see a lot of people have them um, you guys know I don't really have have like I just have those two cash envelopes that I normally use let me see if I can grab one um, here's one of them um, these are from the budget mom and I normally just use two cash envelopes just the groceries and my miscellaneous um, but I have been trying to see like different methods that I can do I'm I'm pretty much down to trying anything except electronic budgeting because that didn't work out for me last year when the whole pandemic happened and you know things were really shut down and stuff so but this I had miscellaneous groceries miscellaneous and that was it um, and then of course my sinking funds but for on a daily basis I really didn't have anything to use as far as for my cash envelopes um, and I have been working to try to get a month ahead um, so I am gonna open this on camera I already blocked all the sensitive information out I think um, so just bear with me here so I am so excited to make sure there's nothing else in there. Oh, I opened this wrong. Ah, so cute. So here is the Clever Fox Budget Planner. I've actually never heard of this until she posted it, um, but I'm down to try it. I am a TBM budgeter, and so far that actually has been really working for me because I'm so simple. Um, I am I like it like bare bones, like very simplistic, like clear. Um, but this has, you can set your goals, create a budget, take control, check spending, check savings, stay organized and feel happier. Um, so that is fun. So it, it says down here, like all the little technical things, hardcover, it lasts up to one year and it's a A5 size. Um, and let me see, 128 pages. So it does have a pocket for your receipts, convenient, money affirmations, strategic strategy and tactics. Y'all, I cannot even read savings tracker, debt payoff tracker, monthly budget, expense tracker, monthly review, and annual progress tracker. So that is fun. I can't wait to open this. I might just open this right now, actually. As soon. Let me see here. I just don't want to rip anything. You know, maybe these, I think these scissors are so dull. Let me grab another pair of scissors. You know, keep hunters always ready. I have scissors everywhere, so I'm always ready. Okay, let me see. This is so cute. I love my favorite color is pink. So this was perfect for me. My goodness. Don't judge me, you guys. I'm just on the struggle bus this week. Ooh, I like it. It feels so cool. It's a fun texture. Ooh, this looks really legit, you guys. This is so fun. Yas, love it. 
Um, I see that there's going to be a lot of writing here. Oh, I do like this mind map. Um, I don't know if you guys jot down your ideas or your to-do list or whatever, but if you're a mind dumper like me, which is like why I have so many post-its everywhere in my life, this mind map is pretty cool. Tactics, strategies, monthly budget, expense tracker, ideas, notes, monthly budget review. So this is pretty cool. This is pretty interesting. I do want to start implementing this um, just because why not? You know, I'm always down to try like a different planner or a different method of budgeting just because even though I am using the TBM budget planner now, which has been working great, how do I know that there's not something out there that's more, you know, that could be better for me, that's more effective um, for me and my family? You never know until you try. So, hey, why not? And, it, oh my gosh, oops, there goes my little Ikea plant. How cute is this? So this is the clear planner that I was talking about that everyone has. Ooh, let me open this up. So exciting. So I just wanted to say thank you to Gabriella Budgets for doing this giveaway. And she was so sweet. To keep me updated and give me the tracking information and everything like that. So this is her cash breakdown slip. I need this. This is so cute. Um, I really like this print. It's kind of like, um, I don't know if you guys can see it. Kind of reminds me of like a giraffe print. I really love these colors. Super fun. And it's reusable. So it is laminated. You can always, you know, write your breakdown and then go home and start over. So I like that it's reusable. And oh, oh, she sent me a note. Chris, thank you so much for entering my giveaway. I hope you truly enjoy your new items. Gabriella Budgets, happy budgeting. So sweet, thank you so much, Gabriella. I really will appreciate this. Don't you worry about it. I'm, all of this is gonna go to good use. Um, these are her no spend stickers. How cute. And there we go, that's a good focus. Um, I have not done a no spend challenge, but maybe I will. Um, oh, I'm so excited, you guys. I don't have any stickers in my planner. Um, let me show you guys what I use. You guys know I don't have like a fancy planner or anything like that, a fancy like budget planner. I just have like, this is a mini notebook it's nothing special um it's super plain it comes in black it comes in white you know it, there's really not much to it and this is just what i use for my planner so if you guys have been following me here on youtube i mean let me see let me just pull up my this is it you guys you guys see it's super plain yeah that's it my bills that's it it's super plain and i don't really do no spend days or no spend challenges but i definitely will most likely in the next few months just so i can use these stickers because how cute and i'm gonna go ahead and open this a6 is it open oh there we go this a6 planner so how cute let me see if I can open these. There we go. And they are all different designs. I think this is super fun. It keeps things a little spicy. So these are her expense trackers for the categories for the cash envelopes. And I really do like, I don't know if you guys can see the border of the I don't know if this is what the paper that she used, the print, but I think this is super fun because like I said, it keeps things a little spicy, you know, a little different. Um, here we are. So these are super cute. Love it. I'm going to go put that to the side and uh, here we go. These are the categories that I chose. So I have a debt envelope and what my plan is to do with this one is if I do use my credit card or if I have money left over or whatever, it's gonna go back into this envelope so I can deposit it into the bank and make my payment. 
groceries, of course. We all know groceries. My number one envelope in the world, groceries. Back to the bank. Um, so this is like if, I, okay, I see what I was doing now. You know, I'm confusing myself, but here we go. So back to the bank, if I use my credit card, right? And I have to make that payment back. Um, I was watching Kadema and I don't know if I'm saying her name right, but please forgive me if I'm say, butchering that. Um, and she had a video where she, she pretty much does everything electronically on her card and then she pays it off. And she does it at the end of the month. I'm not bold enough to do it at the end of the month. I might have to do it at the end of the week. Um, but she does, you know, do that. And so I was thinking maybe I can try that. So if I go to the groceries and they're not taking cash, I can use my credit card and I can, you know, use my credit card and then take the money out of my grocery envelope and put it in this one. So I know that it has to go back to the bank. Now this, this envelope, what I want to do with this one, any extra money from these, I want to put it towards my debt. And I did that separately because it's one thing when I want to go to the bank to make a deposit to pay back my credit card, but it's another thing if I want to make a larger debt payment. And I know people are like, oh, but you know, you're accruing interest, da 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 da. Yeah, I understand I'm accruing interest, but paying off debt isn't just about the money, it's about the mindset. And what I'm working on here is my mindset. So food, this is our eating out food, um, boba. If you guys follow me on Instagram at Chris Budgets, we do a lot of boba, Chick-fil-A. I love to go out for like Dunkin' and Starbucks. So yeah, food. And you guys know, if you guys have been watching and following me on my YouTube channel, I only had two cash envelopes. It was literally just the groceries and the miscellaneous food envelope that I combined into two. Um, but I wanted to separate that, the groceries and the food, and or the food and the miscellaneous. You see how I did that right there? Um, and I wanted to do that because there are so there are other things other than food and you know food and miscellaneous. So I wanted to separate it because one, I wanted to see how much you know food we actually do eat out because I was do like expense tracking but it gets a little messy because okay yeah I'm gonna go get boba but then my husband's gonna go get chick-fil-a for dinner and you know we're gonna go do this and we're gonna go do that and then my sister and her boyfriend are gonna come over for dinner so what envelope is that gonna come out of you know it's just for more clarity for me for our budget we just wanted to see you know what else can we do how can we implement it it definitely i will say i know it's more simple to just have two cash envelopes but doing it this way i just want to see what can i do better um is this going to be more effective for me and also i wanted to be able to carry this into my purse um, you guys know I don't have any special wallets or anything like that, but I just had my regular wallet that I use and I would just take like our grocery money or our miscellaneous food money and I would just throw that in my wallet and then go, but then I would forget, oh, what, what goes here, what goes there, and I would have to save my receipts. And if they ask you, oh, would you like a receipt for your purchase today? No, I'm good, thank you. That was me. I would say that I don't need a receipt, but in reality, when I get home, I, I need the receipt. I already forgot how much I paid. So yeah, all of this to say that I wanted a better breakdown, category breakdown for myself so we can um, track our expenses better and see how much better we can really track our money and meet our goals. But I just wanted to say again, thank you to Gabriella Budgets for this cute giveaway and I can't wait to show you guys how I'm gonna use my new binder. Thank you so much for watching you guys and I will see you in my next video.